Hello, I hope I reached you in good spirits. Um, I'm in pretty good spirits myself. Thanks for asking. Um, <laughs> my name is Caliber. I go by a lot of names. And uh, whatever name I go by, you put respect on that name. Um, <clears throat> I, I'm i happy. I, I'm happy. I, I, I heard some pretty good news um, in the realm of MCU. Um, I read a very good article. Um, I think it was like um, a Netflix-like article with uh, um, some information on... Um, the NAACP Image Awards concerning um, Megan Good and Jonathan Majors. And, you know, they they charmed everyone <laughs> with their presence there. And they were a charming couple. And um, I, w I wish them all the best. I really do. I wish them all the best. Um, I'm not going to stand here too long, um, but... Some more good news I heard, which let me just stop and say it was good news to see um, Jonathan Majors around his um, his comrades. It was it was good. It was good. And um, I like to see things like that. Um, I like to see people do well. I like to see people succeed. Call me strange, but that's just that's just how I roll. I, I, I dig positivity. Um, but uh, as soon as. I got through seeing that and I saw that courtesy of uh Miss Pam on Pam Entertainment TV and uh I saw um it was a uh, particular um video that Dre Mag did. Um please go to those two um YouTubers um videos, um Dre Mag and Pam TV. Um I was very impressed with the thorough job they both did concerning uh, Mr. Majors and Miss Good. Um, I need to start addressing them like that because I don't know them. <laughs> so <laughs> I need to address them like that. Um, but, uh, they did a wonderful job and the author, I cannot remember this. Um, I'm sorry, the, the reporter, I can't remember the, um, reporter's name, the journalist's name on Netflix on their site. It's a Netflix like site, but they did a wonderful job. They really did. You know, Hey. I'm always up here talking about all oh, these people. They can't do a good job. And da, 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 and they, this person did a good job. And um, I'll see if I can put a link so you can um, see the article, the web article they did. They did a good job. Um, I want you all to know that um, I'm still doing the petition for Magazine Dreams to be streamed on Netflix. I guess. And uh, for it to be streamed on Netflix, um, if it's streamed on Hulu, um, even better. I'm not mad. I'm just trying to see the movie. So, you know, I'll take the movie any way I can get the movie. <laughs> it be it Netflix, be it Hulu. Just want to see it. You know, just want to see it. Um, also, I have another petition for um, King Dynasty to be resurrected along with um, Jonathan Majors as Kang in a starring role, which leads me to why I'm in a good, in a good mood. The reason I'm in a good mood, um, there's a lot of talk that uh, the MCU is sticking with Kang um, for Avengers 5, which I feel should have stayed Kang Dynasty. Um, the MCU is slimming some things down and they're, um, I guess for lack of a better word, downsizing and, uh, between COVID and Bob paycheck. Um, I guess so. Um, I still feel like, um, Bob paycheck. I still feel like Bob paycheck, um, had a lot to do with Wakanda forever. Um, I'm not going to be mad at Ryan Coogler. I'm not going to be mad at Nate Moore. I'm not going to be mad at Kevin Feige. I feel now, um, looking back, I feel now that, uh, that may have had a lot to do with Bob Paycheck. Um, but, uh, I see where they're cutting some things down. Um, I really wanted to see Eternals too. And as far as Captain Marvel three, 
I don't really think we got a Captain Marvel 2. But um, hopefully they will be added into the mix later. Um, I really wanted to get an Eternals 2. Because there's a lot of backstory in the MCU that could have been told through Eternals 2. And a lot of stuff with Odin. A lot of stuff with Ego. Could have been told with Eternals 2. A lot of stuff with Thanos. Could have been told through Eternals 2. Maybe there's a connection between Fastos and Wakanda. We'll never, well, we won't know for now because they're putting Eternals 2 on hold. So, hey. But um, the best news I heard is that uh, Kang is staying, which, you know, I'm kind of, you know, trying to come on, let's get to something else. You know, come on, you know, let's pull something else because we got Kang coming, st well, Kang staying. Now can we get Jonathan Majors staying too? Because nobody can really do Kang but Jonathan Majors. Um, Dre Matt, you had a wonderful idea of having Coleman Domingo play um, Brother Brother Voodoo, Dr. Voodoo. Um, Dr. Voodoo is a great character. And I mean, gray. I didn't mean great. You know, I'm sure Coleman Domingo can make him great. But um, he's not like a household name. I'm talking about um, Brother Voodoo slash Dr. Voodoo. But that is a wonderful idea to have um, Coleman Domingo play... Um, Dr. Voodoo. Um, that would be great. Um, but I was very, very happy to hear the news um, today um, online. Well, I won't say news, but what should I say? What was said. <laughs> Got to be careful. I don't want to be like these other people. Um, what was said online about um, Kang coming, well, Kang staying. Um, I think that's a normal, natural order of the story. And uh, I think with Kang staying, um, it'll make us appreciate Dr. Doom. So I think that's very, very smart in a storytelling fashion for them to do that. Now, to bring the drama on home, um, hey, you know, y'all give dude a call. Give Jonathan Majors a call and make this happen. Um, I'm happy that he's happy. Uh, dude look like he's floating on cloud nine and he needs a break. He needs a break. He needs the positivity. He needs the joy. He needs the laughter. He really needs it. And I'm happy that he's happy. Um, but that's all I got for y'all. Um, I'm running around here doing a lot of things and, um, doing a lot of things. got a lot of stuff cooking. Uh, Hey, tell me if y'all agree with um Dre Mag. Tell if you tell tell me if you agree with me about Eternals too. Um, I'm trying to open up a comment section so people can talk, and I'm trying to make my <laughs> my videos shorter so my voice won't crack. So <laughs> that will happen. Uh, I'm not even using a radio voice right now. I'm just using my own voice. And hey, you know, when I start seeing dollar signs come up. I will use my radio voice, but I'm not going to uh, uh, do all that. I'm not going to be that dramatic. I'm just going to keep it real for y'all. But uh, I want everybody to, um, as I've always said this year, I want everybody to vote. Um, I want everybody to stop being so negative. Um, I've seen so much negativity in these last 48 hours. I'm like, really, y'all? Just be happy for people. If you if you emit that happiness, that happiness in turn will come back to you. Just 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 be happy. Now some people you have to fight for, some people you have to stand up for. I get that. And some issues you have to stand up for. And there is no choice. You must do it. But all the hate and grown folks name calling and coming at folks, um, hey, as my mama would say, you may be picking your cotton to get a hundred. Be careful how you come at people. You don't know what's going on with them. <laughs> Be careful how you come at people. Okay, just keep keep it safe and just keep it positive. But I want everybody to vote, stay safe, and love all your tribes. <laughs>